this shit and I got some questions and you'd be like, you could tell like this motherfucker only been watching college football for about a year now. I know he do a little bit of research because he sound like he gives you, you could tell, but damn, like, you know what I'm saying? But he puts up with that. He's the real MVP, y'all. So give it, give Shad a hand at home. Please do that. Get in the chat, put some clapping hands for him, man, because he putting up with my ass. But yeah, they um y'all two and a half point favorite over Florida. <laughs> I mean, so I think I'm not I'm not a gambling person, but obviously we're going to their place. So if this game was in Miami, then I think that probably would make us probably might well say a touchdown favorite, right? So um looking at the talent composition of the team, which I, I don't know how they're doing this, according to Blue chip ratio, the Florida Gators are more talented than we are, even though we mm -hmm. picked up some some key transfers. But obviously all this stuff is predicated on, you know, high school. So obviously Cam Ward was a, a no-star prospect coming out of Texas. Um, This game is interesting. Yeah, very. In, 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 many, in many particular aspects because I think you do have to take into consideration. Um, we do have a, a quarterback. He was here for the spring. It uh, seems he's getting a lot of autonomy. Um, one of the things that we didn't talk about is the aspect of now they have the helmet, you know, like like in the NFL now where the offensive coordinator can communicate with the quarterback now. So, I mean, it's going to be interesting to kind of see how, how that goes. Um, like I said, one of the biggest issues with Cam Ward that people had was the ball security, you know, questions, um, the aspect of playing hero ball. Stuff like that. So, like I said, I mean, like I said last week, man. You know, the two, the two concerns or the two things about this particular team that <clears throat> I want to keep an eye on are with the offensive line. If there will there be a drop off from last year, mm -hmm. and how well the secondary is going to perform. So those are my those are my two things. I do feel like that Florida has gotten some, you know, some decent receivers that can kind of help Graham Mertz out. So our DBs are going to have to, you know, they're going to be ready. Uh, Florida has a, you know, um, a solid, you know, defensive line. Um, I don't think it's as good as advertised. I don't think it's as good as what, you know, what we have. So, I mean, it, to me, it's, it's just going to be about what game plan we try to um, bring forth. I do mm. think we're going to try to um, early take the run game away from them. I do think that's going to be the point of emphasis. You know, um, I was listening to one of another uh, Miami fan yesterday. He was just talking about just, you know, just some of the size of, you know, some of the offensive lines that, you know, we got to play and how our defensive line is not as big, um, you know, most notably in the middle as, you know, you would want them to be. But maybe they can, you know, over compensate for that via their quickness. So, like I said, we have some guys that got here after the, you know, after the spring window that's going to have to get, you know, that's going to be dependent upon to, you know, make some plays. So, again, me. What's your defensive coordinator's name? Lance Gidry. Lance Gidry. Do you think that Lance Gidry is going to make the – he, he going to call the correct defense a good game against Florida? I mean, because – What's Obviously, it? they got they uh they quarterback coming back. Uh, what's his name again? The damn quarterback down there in Florida. Help me Graham out, bro. Mertz. Graham Mertz, right? He's 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 like a vet, right? Um, yeah. Graham Mertz. They got they got some interchangeable interchangeable running backs down there, but I think y'all running back coach Matt. I can't pronounce. I'm bad with name. Matt Merrick. I don't know if that's his name or whatever, but it, it, that Damien. Y'all should beat Florida. I give it to y'all, bro. I just wanted to try to give you some hell. I wasn't gonna do. I wasn't. I was gonna troll, but I'm like, I'm not about to troll my dog. Like, cause I got Miami winning the ACC. I might be. I gotta be clear about that. I do got y'all winning the ACC. I do. Um, I don't see nobody. I don't. I just don't see nobody. But I do think I will say this. Now, y'all might not. Y'all may disagree with me because y'all are Miami fans, and you could y'all could say what y'all want to say. But I feel like. This game right here is the jump off the Miami season. What y'all beat the Gators by is the jump off to y'all season. Period. I think I think it's a barometer for y'all. And, and, and I, let me explain that a little bit more. Like let me let me explain that for for y'all. This is how I feel, right? This is my opinion on what the outlook of Miami season may be. I do got y'all winning the ACC, but look. So 
if y'all go in there and beat the Gators by 10, I still think y'all could go 11 and 1. You know what I'm saying? But I think there's going to be some challenges. Y'all going to face more adversity. If y'all go out there and just put the beats on Florida, I don't see nobody fucking with y'all. I don't see no messing with y'all. Period. Period. You know what I'm saying? So that's what I mean by the, my barometer for the Miami hurricane season like that. That's what I think. You know what I'm saying? Like, I just don't see nobody at messing with y'all. For real. It depends on how y'all go out there and stomp them to me. But what you think? He said, Shad, we got a mute button. We finna quiet all this ish up in the swamp. Uh, I say my main concern with the Canes this year is the lack of discipline. We had over 700 penalties young in the yards last year. Mm. I mean, I don't, I, I don't, I don't, I didn't look at it that way, but penalties matter. That matters a lot, DP. A lot yeah. talking penalties and yards, bro. That matters a lot in these games. Discipline does. I agree. I agree with that, DP. It, it that matters a whole lot, whole lot. But I think that's what I meant by the barometer of this season with the with the Miami Hurricanes and um this Florida Gators game, bro. What you looking at up there, Shad? What you mean? When you when you go up, what, that that's what the TV at, right? No, no. Usually when I do that, I'm just thinking about what you're saying. Oh, okay, you know, okay. All so, right. Yeah, because I don't just stare. You know what I mean? So. <laughs> <laughs> I look at it and see like, okay, yeah, that, that's a good point. Yeah. Yeah. That's, I mean, that's just what I feel like, you know, that's just, that's not, that's not really fact based. That's just more of opinion based on what I, what I, you know what I mean? What I feel. That's all. That's, it's not really a, a fact based, you know, statement, you know, behind that. That's, but that's just what I, that's what I feel like. I mean, cause y'all gotta, y'all gotta, you gotta give it up, you know, Florida, Billy Napier, his they got a tough schedule, bro. They have the hardest schedule in college football. The hardest schedule in college yeah. football the Florida Gators do. Yeah. But you know, that's the that's the that's the thing about <clears throat> preseason stuff. Preseason says they have the toughest schedule because you're looking at some names. You're right. But until that season is actually fully played, yeah, that postseason, after looking at it. It might not be the toughest schedule, you know. Right. So yeah. I mean, so I mean, I mean, I mean again, like I said, it's 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 gonna be interesting. It's a rivalry game, you know. The last time we played Florida, I felt like both teams, for the most part, were evenly matched um, in many aspects, and it really just came down to us not executing in some in some critical places. Mm -hmm. But again, that's a part of football. Um, most teams do not play a a perfect game. And unfortunately, there may be a handful of plays that get further scrutinized and maybe, oh, well, hey, do you know that if that guard would have made that block on that kick out, instead of that being a two-yard run, that could have been a block to get him 20-some-odd yards and that right. could have been a touchdown, you know? So, so like I said, it's, 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 a lot, it's a lot of plays, you know what I mean? Um, our coaching staff... You know, from what from what we have should be better. You know, you asked me about Lance Gidry and what I think Lance Gidry is going to do. The thing mm -hmm. to me about this is that, and this is on both sides, where you have time as a, as a coaching staff, especially now with the advent of them having essentially unlimited assistance right now. Um, it's really going to come, again, it's, it's back to being a coaching part of it. You know, you spoke about mm -hmm. earlier about college coaching being underrated. And a, yeah. I believe that a, a lot. A lot of people do. A lot of people feel like coaching is overrated. They feel like that you just amass gobs of talent on the team and just sit them out there on the field and you know that. horse up the trophies. But right now, with this transfer portal and what we have going on now. Um, Coaching is, is of the utmost importance. So we're going to actually get to see which particular um, team and staff are going to be able to look at film, pick up tendencies, and, you know, figure out what figure out what exactly is the correct way to attack what it is that they're doing. Mm -hmm. Obviously, Florida lost a big piece of their offense in Trevor Etienne um, this past, you know, going to the University of Georgia. It's going to be interesting to see how they, you know, compensate for that. You know what I mean? So, again, you know, it's, it's it, I mean, it's a, it's gonna be an interesting game. Man, you know? look, with Shannon, like, what, 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 